Yellow Productions presents Venice Beach, California, Hippies by the Sea. Hello, I am Chris Rainey, like a rainy day, bringing you Venice Beach, sometimes called the Ghetto by the Sea. Now, it feels like it's the cheapest way to feel like you're out of the country. Just drive here, and it feels nothing like the rest of Los Angeles. Venice Beach was founded by tobacco millionaire Abbott Kinney to be the Venice of America, complete with canals, gondolas, and Venetian-themed buildings. Unfortunately, most of Abbott Kinney's original vision of Venice, the piers, the amusements, uh, have been long torn down, but what does remain a popular tourist attraction is the Venice Beach Boardwalk. The Boardwalk is an interesting collection of tourists, shops, street vendors, performers, and just downright right crazy people. Take for instance this guy. His name is Harry Perry. He's famous in Venice. He rollerblades around, plays the electric guitar, and sells people t-shirts. <laughs> this guy with the pot on his head is the Venice Beach pot man. This guy just needs to wear some more clothes. This guy comes out to the boardwalk to play the piano. Pretty good, but pretty strange to play the piano on the boardwalk. And of course, no collection of mental hospital patients would be complete without our friends, the Hare Krishnas. Then there's these two, which make a very natural singing group. Even homeless people can come out to entertain with their electric guitar on the boardwalk. Okay, well, there are other things in Venice Beach besides crazy people. Take, for example, Muscle Beach, an outdoor bodybuilding area where people can come and lift weights out in the sun. Venice is actually where Arnold Schwarzenegger got his start lifting weights. On the boardwalk, there are also outdoor racquetball courts, volleyball courts, and basketball courts. Venice is also famous for its tradition of outdoor street vendors. People come to the boardwalk, set up, and sell just about everything. And sometimes, I'm not really sure what they're selling. Your guess is as good as mine for what these folks are selling. Venice is also the premier place in Southern California to find a good drum circle. I've never seen a drum circle quite as big as this one, or with such enthusiastic dancers. Let's watch the drum circle for a little while. secondhand smoke from the drum circle. <laughs> I'm starting to see people. I've made some new friends. Let me introduce you to them. Here I've got Ghosty. Uh, I've got my new friend Birdie. I've got Yellowy. And oh, my best friend right here, Leroy. Leroy, we're my main squeeze. Man, that, that, that smoke from the drum circle, it's really starting to act up. I'm, I think I'm seeing things. Well, wishing you a good evening from Venice, California. As the Venetians would say in Italy, ciao. Or in Venice, as the drum circlers would say, 